All right. Um, I'm going to show you how I'm going to clean these mirrors on this truck because they're the most disgusting. They get bugs on them and on the highway and they've actually dug right into the mirrors. I got them West Coast style mirrors. So here I'll show you what they're like. See them bugs? I wash it. Whatever. You. They just. They're bad. All right. So this is what I'm using. Uh, I'm gonna wet sand first. And I'm using 1500 grit sandpaper. Could go a little better than that, but got a little water bottle full of uh, water. <laughs> 1500 grit sandpaper. And let's see how she works. Get her nice and wet. Hey, let's uh, close the window. No power window. Anyway. This is going to take a while, but I'm just sanding all the guts off. Alright, so this is the uh, piece, it's still wet, I've just finished now. If you can see here, you know, it's not the greatest job. I'm not a professional, just so you all know, because hey, I don't know at all, right? I just do what I can, but, anyways, even that looks better than it did. So, see, there's no more, no more bugs, bugs are all gone. Man, do they ever eat into this stuff? I'll tell you that. So, now I'm gonna dry it off. And uh, I'll get back to you with my next step. Bye. Alrighty. So I've done uh, I've done the uh, wet sanding. I kind of cleaned it off, and looks a lot better now. Anyways, uh, now comes the polishing part. Now I've kind of been screwing around with stuff. I figure 1,500. That's good enough for sandpaper. But uh, I found this little idea. They're one of these balls, right? And uh, polishing balls. And this one's like euchred. There's, it's no good anymore, right? So I thought, well, what can I do? Well, I had a. I use for my rims. I, I do. I do my rims by hand. So. Um, you have to excuse me. I have to think of what I'm saying. Um, but I, I found that, uh, you know, it, it seems to be really good stuff. This is 100% cotton, this uh, t-shirt that I got. And I've doubled it up. I double it up, right? Because I found that if I only use one layer, uh, it goes through. So I take this guy, right? And uh, hold on a sec. Give it a good fold here anyways. I take this guy and I put him over top, right? Kind of like a condom. No, not really. But uh, I take a zip tie, or you could use whatever you want, but I find zip ties are good. And um, give her a zip. Not too hard. Cut this little end off. Now, if I leave it like this, ooh, ghost. Anyways, if I leave it like this, obviously you know what's going to happen. Right? So that has to be snipped off. So I snip. I snip and I snip and I snip. Ow. So 
Well, it's a little hard to do, but get all this crud off. And I find that this works better than the uh, I find this works better than the actual polishing balls and the mothers and stuff. So anyways, there it is. And that really does a good job, believe it or not. Today, just like any other day, because, you know, I find what's cheap. I found this uh, Blue Magic um, metal polish. Seems to work pretty good. I don't know. Uh, well, I guess I'll set up, get started, and I'll show you how it comes out. Late. Okay. So, just a drill, high speed. This one goes to 3000, so it's pretty quick. And I know you're not supposed to go quick all the time, but I find with this, it works better quick. Besides, I'm impatient. All right, so let's see what happens here. Just give it a bit of a rub in. <laughs> All right, so I'm done doing what I was doing, and uh, I, I couldn't get right in the corners with it, but uh, you can see as I'm wiping all this crap off, it's, it's coming out. I'll have to figure out how to get in here. I know how I should have done it, but... But uh, I got a Dremel tool I could use. But I mean, that looks a heck of a lot better than uh, than bugs, right? I see some spots I missed. You know, I missed a lot of spots. Wow, that was just horrible. Yeah. But. You can see I'm getting there. Oh, there it is. Yeah. That's the way it should look, right there. You know? But, uh, you see in the corners there, I gotta get all that. Well, I guess, uh, I guess I'll continue on. Ha, I had to show you. But this is basically, you know, spinning around. There we go. Now the sun's on you, but there you go. Kinda. I don't know. It's not too bad. One thing I, I didn't mention is, uh, you know, uh, after you're done, you're truck or whatever is going to need one hell of a bath. I got junk all over it, all over me. You know, expect that. So there she is. It's my pride and joy right there. 